Mercury is a city dog. He lives in Sunnyside, Queens. New York Magazine recently ranked Sunnyside number three out of 60 neighborhoods in their list of New York City's best places to live. That sounds pretty great, so let's look at Sunnyside from Mercury's perspective. His block is nestled between a couple of burger joints and around the corner from a bagel shop. Plenty of opportunities for sidewalk snacking. The neighbors are friendly, and they seem to love dogs. This means more snacks. Dogs need plenty of exercise. This is especially true for Weimaraners. Even though he will be 10 this year, he hasn't slowed down much. Neither has his appetite. It's easy for him to put on a few extra pounds if he's not careful. Mercury's people are very active. They take him on long walks and even go jogging with him. But when he needs to run around off leash, Mercury has nowhere to go. Because in the New York Magazine rankings, even though it has lots of great qualities, Sunnyside came in nearly last in green space, 55th out of 60. This is the closest dog park to where Mercury lives. It's way too small for most dogs to run in and sits atop a steep hill. Sometimes Mercury gets to go to a dog park in Brooklyn, but to get there you have to take a highway. As much as he would like to, Mercury doesn't drive. A group of Mercury's dog friends have been gathering in this playground every evening for the past nine years. Their people have petitioned the city to build a dog park there. They have the approval, they have the plans all drawn up, but with the budget crisis, they just don't have the money. So the dogs squeeze into the playground, dodging soccer balls and munching on the food people leave behind. It's not safe for dogs, or for the kids who play there. Mercury's not getting any younger. Won't you make his dream come true and help build him and his friends a dog park in Sunnyside?